It's Friday morning with Chloe. Ooh. Training, where are you? Chloe, he just said I'd call you back. Chloe, toi. Training, hi. Chloe, this is a dress that is not really our colors. It has some blue, so it might be good for your eyes. It's harder in a way for you than for me, but I think the shape of the dress is divine. Yes. We want to try and make it work. So I'm thinking for you, Chloe, Sasha and Mia. Sasha and Mia, yes. And I'm happy for a smoky eye. Let's try that this time. I mean, I'm going the coolest I've ever gone. So I'm a little bit nervous. Silver. Empress and Star and Justice and Pia. Okay, whoa. I'm going to start with blusher because I know I need to see some life on my face to then go to my lips and eyes. Blusher, do you reckon I should do Sasha on the cheeks as well? Or shall I do a little bit of cut? You could do Catherine. Little, I've done a tiny bit of Pia. And then I'm going to go to Justice, Chloe, which I hardly ever use. So I want to get a base on my eye, which is even. Okay, my face is already more alive with Catherine. You know, we want to feel the aliveness of our face when we put on our makeup, Chloe, don't we? Yes. You're looking now, you've woken up. It's crazy, okay. I'm doing a wash of lovers. I'm not doing it strong. Picked up Charlie's and Lovers. Let's see how I'm going to build this up. You're going for a sexier, smokier eye, and I'm going for a sort of more, the focus is on the bright lip. What did you plan for the lips then? I might do Pia with something over, you know. But it's very nice that lovers can be really that it's got a lilacness to it if you look closely. Chalice somehow as well, is not it? Oh, but Chalice does by nature, Chloe. Did you do star last week? Last week, you've done star. So I'm just doing it in my corner of my eye. You love star though. That's amazing with your blue eyes. There's something about it which makes me so happy. I'm on a roll here. Also, it's good to feel like bright as stars isn't it it's good to feel bright stars you know Trini just while we chat yeah I have only one little tattoo behind my ear and it's actually a little star well you have a tattoo it's actually because when I was uh, younger my dad was like you always should be bright like a star I never saw it show it to me something you never knew about Chloe she has a star tattoo behind her ear <gasps> Lila hasn't gone down that path yet. You know, it's interesting building up lovers. But I don't want to turn into Barbara Cartland. <gasps> so I want to make sure I look a bit more modern. Fair enough. <laughs> Did you see Lila do my makeup? Oh my God, she was so good. She worked really good. Thanks, Lila. I think she took every highlighter under the sun, actually. I'm only doing it with starlight. And it just gave a different dimension to the highlighter. The, yes. I mean, it's like the playfulness you bring when you do your makeup. Because I just, sometimes I say, I think you should do this. And then you're like, oh, I'm thinking this. And I'm thinking, oh my God. And then it's quick. <laughs> So what I try to do now <laughs> is using a little bit of Sasha in the corner of the eye as you've done with Star last time. Of course you are. Do you think the peer looks all right? Look. Yeah, that's really good, actually. It just gives a coolness, but I need to know if I just put a tiny bit here, that thing of bringing everything together. I really like it on the lips. Chloe, it's looking great from here. I don't know, it feels very grey on the eyes. Put a bit of star in, because what it does is it just adds a bit of va vum yeah. which I think you always feel the need for... <laughs> a little bit, you know. Oh my God, it looks like silver foil. You know what your vibe is turning into a bit? It's a 60s vibe, because this print is very like 60s dress. And I'm yes. going softer with uh, Maddie. Yeah. 60 Disco Queen with this stuff on my eyes. Well, disco Queen 70, get your bloody decades right, madam. Psychedelic 60s. Think psychedelic, Chloe. Right, I'm gonna get me on the eyes then if I have to think psychedelic. <laughs> <laughs> what have I started, my God? I'm nearly done, Chloe. I'm going to go and accessorize, and I'll see you on our little Friday Tweety Cool Florals. Chloe, I think this looks gorgeous on you. How do you feel in it? Look at these. Like, I love a puffy sleeve, and this is just the epitome of a puffy sleeve. It is so that, and I think a puffy sleeve allows girls with big boobs to wear high round necks because the sleeve takes over and your boobs don't dominate. It makes your waist really small the bigger your shoulders are. So I like that just, you know, giving that real hourglassy. I nearly am an hourglass. You are, and I love the belt, how you used it and the color. I need you to do the belt, darling, because it's quite high-waisted, whereas for you it's perfect. And I'll just show you what I did with the shoe and then you show me, but I was thinking of Pia and I had these shoes here from Sophia Webster. But the heel is the same color as Pia. So I thought, why not? I love it. What about you, darling? I've got these rose gold sandals, which yeah. I thought oh, the shape is lovely. 
And as accessory, I have these Zara earrings that are the same color as the dress and as your belt. So I thought they would fit. And I have to say, this dress is size 14 and not because I lost weight or like maybe the opposite, but because this ASOS dress comes quite generous. So this is yeah. good about this dress as well. Fantastic. Yes, it is ASOS for everyone who's asking and wondering. But darling, have a lovely weekend. And um, I hope you get a chance to wear it. Yes. Thank you, Trini. Bye, darling. Bye. Bye.